I think of makeup like your face makeup. No, you, but I think you, you mean different makeup. You make up poetically. Well, because he's five million dollars in debt and has to get money from somebody to pay the bills. Ah, Netflix's unlimited employee vacation policy and why it works. This one I've not been able to figure out. Netflix has tanked again, and they're, and they're, everybody is praising how they can, you know, about all the vacation time. Well, maybe if they didn't take so much vacation time and they actually were on the job, you might have people that, uh, when they do an IPO, that the next day don't raise the cost of everything and destroy the worth of the company. Yeah, what's the meaning of that one? They said Netflix is probably overvalued always, and basically it's lost 50% of its value since they did the IPO, because they've done one, well, we're not going to do DVDs anymore. Well, that killed them. Well, we're going to stream, we're going to give you video if it's going to cost you more than we were doing it before. Now, we're going to split all of this off. They, they have got no coercive policy in the company about how to run it. Um. Maybe they should come back for vacation. <laughs> yeah, probably it. Yeah. Snap, snap, scientists create a basic crab-powered computer. I, I know. Crab, basically, you have to put little crabs on a treadmill. Well, we know they do this with elevators. They, they, put, they put chipmunks or mice or ground squirrels in an elevator on a treadmill, and that's how the elevators go up and down buildings. And Rami says his grandfather went broke more than once. Yeah, most, a lot of grandfathers have went broke more than once. He, he, basically, he, he, it's only a silver spoon if you get handed everything you have in your life. If your family has to work for it, it's not a silver spoon, folks. Ah. Obama is silver spoon. Obama never worked for anything he ever got in his life. People gave it to him. That's what they mean by silver spoon. And they're trying to get that, that the guy that actually never worked a day in his life, well, well he was a teacher. Anybody want I know called a teacher a working job? Yeah. <laughs> And no new clues in searching for missing six-year-old Tucson girl. And they won't because once they disappear, they disappear, folks. You never find them. Oh. And police, four kids die in Louisiana home fire and mom charged. Yeah, because she basically wasn't there. Now, uh, uh, my here's the problem is, I come from an era when the parents, when they were out working, left the kids at home. So that was nothing uncommon. The day. You leave the kids at home and you got too many things that they could get into, which we didn't have when I was young. We didn't have television. We did have, we actually... We you didn't, didn't have televisions when you were young? Not when I was little, we didn't. That was before TV. I'm from the oh. pre unky milky time. Oh. No, but we did have radios, but we didn't have microwave ovens, we didn't have cell phones. But you know, they also took you guys to work. Oh yeah, that was a whole bit. Was they, but you can't do that. We, my mother would take me to work, take, take us to work. We ended up, we ended up on a lot of sets in, in restaurant kitchens too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And soccer ball swept up by a Japanese tsunami found in Alaska. I know. I mean, I, I, it, it, it floated across the ocean eventually. Mm. And Walmart scandal lifts lid on culture of bribery in Mexico. Um, anybody ever watch, you know, the Academy Award winning performance by Anthony Quinn? Mm -hmm. when he, you know, basically when he was playing the right hand to, you know, to, uh, uh, and, and was, you know, Zapata. I mean, he basically, he, 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 they, it's been this way since the very beginning of Mexican government. It's, and then the Obama administration is going to, they're going to have the Justice Department investigate Walmart, which basically means they want Walmart to become a union company and they'll drop an investigation, which can't go anywhere since they have no, no legal right to investigate somebody that broke no laws in this country. And Holland's victory could impact the U.S. markets this week. Yeah, because what happens is, okay, the Dutch, the, basically, their economy just took it. The French, basically, uh, are, are going to elect a socialist and the, and the market going to... But today, the markets actually went up on really good news to see low, you know, uh, more people filing for unemployment, housing sales continue to tank, uh, and... People don't believe the economy is going in the right direction. And the market went up. Mm -hmm. And Florida woman going on trial in 2009, Novak Killings. Oh, yeah. That's, uh, but, you know, that, okay. What happens is if you kill somebody, it's called don't ever come back to where you killed the people because you tend to get caught. Oh, really? That's what happened? Yeah, that's where they, it really is. Ten, criminals tend to return to the scene of their crime. Why? Because they're stupid. What, are they sentimental? No, it's just they think that they can come back. You know, it just uh, 
Go listen to Thomas Wolfe. You can never come home again. Listen to him and you'll leave and don't ever come. Got to rob somebody, kill somebody. Don't ever go back to where you did the job. I thought they always came back because then they wanted to rob you again after you had no. ownership. No, no, no. They, they, they don't because that's... They never, that's only in the, Jesse James would rob the same place more than once. Oh. Most people don't rob the same thing, business twice. <laughs> Please hope grainy photos, oh, well actually, search for long, miss, long missing New York boy fails to find remains. Yeah, see, that's the second newest thing because they did, after 35 years, you're not going to find anything. It just didn't got to happen. An iPod Nano burst into flames costing Apple $7,400. Well, yeah, everybody knew. Okay, here's the problem with iPod. And oh. Apple knows they have problems with their equipment. You didn't turn the, the switch. I did animosity bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay. Faster doesn't always mean better. 